हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई धैर्य भाटिया वेलकम यू टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल मैथ्स डीएनए फ्रॉम ओरिजिन टू इन्फिनिटी इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ जनरल एप्टीट्यूड फ्रॉम द एग्जामिनेशन ऑफ सी एस आई नेट दैट वॉज कंडक्टेड ऑन सिक्सटीन ऑफ फेब्रुआरी बट बिफोर दैट लेट मी शेयर समथिंग विथ यू वी हैव मेड एन ऑल इन वन बुक विच इज यूजफुल फॉर द प्रिपरेशन ऑफ फोर डिफरेंट एग्जामिनेशन दैट इज नेट गेट set and state public service commission examination with question bank solution bank and necessary and sufficient material for this you can register at our whatsapp number given below moving on to the question the question was from the section of general aptitude c before we begin the question it is very important for you to know that general aptitude is a very easy and scoring part in any examination many students ignore this part but i personally believe that you should at least prepare few topics from the general aptitude so can so you can easily qualify any examination now moving on to the question the question is the square of a digit number a two digit number with non zero digits is the number itself preceded by the digit c then c is the options are a1 B two, C four, and D six. Let us first understand this question and then solve it. In the question, they are saying that you have a two-digit number, and when you square it, you get the same number again, but with a preceder digit, that is C. So, firstly, we take the digits. All the digits are zero, one, two, up to nine, and we square them we are not taking a two digit number we are only taking the last digit of any two digit number can be so this will give us the square of 0 will be 0 1 give 1 the square of 2 will be 4 the square of 3 will be 9 and so on we are only interested in the last digit we can here clearly see that the last digit is repeated with the digits 0 1 5 and 6 but in the question it is also mentioned that the two digit number is non zero it is having non zero digits so the last digit as zero is also not possible so the only remaining last digits are 1 5 and 6 and now we have to consider all the two digit numbers with last digit as 1 5 and 6 let us begin so the 11 square will be 121 15 square 225 16 square 256 21 square is 441 and 25 square gives us 625 many students knew directly that the 25 will be remaining so you can directly take this but if you are not knowing this then you can solve it in this manner it will hardly take 2 minutes and thus the preceder of the number 625 of 25 will be 6 which is option d hence the correct answer is option d thank you and you can be a member of our social club and watch dat plus videos on our youtube channel and get a complete study material for any higher mathematics competitive exam from our telegram channel